Hey, strain gauges are used for a lot of different uh, measurement applications. I want to show you here that they can also be used for displacement measurement. It just depends on how the transducer is designed. So the way this thing works, you can see the plunger going up and down there. And this is a wedge. I know it's hard to see in the video, but this is actually a triangular shaped wedge. And what you see here is a constant stress cantilever beam with the contact point being this bearing. And you can see it's cantilever here. Well, there's two of them. There's one on this side as well. So as this displaces, you can see those uh, constant stress beams uh, deforming and, and rolling on those bearings. Well, that does a couple of things. Well, one, of course, bends the beam and we get a signal from a full bridge strain gauge application. You can see the wiring here. Um, but also very cleverly, that uh, force causes the plunger to go back again. 